You've reserved up front if you'd like to move. Now, I've heard parents say, you know, I didn't get to see my child, so we thought we would just put them up front, that way they can. Uh, this is our creek bank, and uh, this is where it all happens for these kids to tell about Jesus. And I want to thank everyone for their prayers and for their support and for helping us get this started. And if now, we'll get it started.
<laughs> hey, you ever heard those echoes out here? Well, just listen to that rock over there. Hello! Hello! Wow. Well, just listen to that deep valley down there. Hello! Hello! Yeah. Well, just listen upon that tall mountain up there. Hello! <laughs> I said listen upon that tall mountain up there. Hello! <laughs> hey, Jane, I can't climb up there. Somebody stole the ladder. <laughs>
If you could be any animal in the world, what would you be? Well, I don't know, but my mother would like for me to be the Long Ranger's horse. The Long Ranger's horse? Why? Because every time she looks at the trash, she says, tootie dump, tootie dump, tootie dump, dump, dump. <laughs> if I could be an animal, I'd be a frog. Oh. A frog? Why? So I can eat what bugs me. <laughs> Come on up to my father's house and join our family. 
told you I'd show you how to catch a fish, and here's how. Oh, cool it. You're just bragging. Yeah, but here's the proof. Pretty big, huh? Probably enough to feed us all. You can't begin to feed us all with just that one fish. Well, in that case, I'll have to catch one more. I heard a story once where Jesus fed 5,000 people with just two fish. So with one more... Anybody want to try two, three tuna fish sandwiches for one peanut butter and jelly? No! How about for one half peanut butter and jelly? No! That's enough tuna to feed us all. Yeah, I hadn't been caught to believe in miracles. I'd say that's how God fed those 5,000 people with just two fish and bread. It could have been tuna fish. Tuna goes a long way. Little barefoot boy running through the sand. What you got in that basket in your hand? There's 5,000 people waiting to be fed. How'd you like to share your fish and bread? To sum it all up, you simply divide. Watch your bread and fish just multiply. Add a little faith, subtract all your doubt. Just watch it all work out.
happy thing. Aww. Aww. If you hurry, we might have time for some stories. Hey, James, come over here and help me, help me carry all my fishing stuff. Sure, I'll be glad to. Want to carry the fish? Sure, absolutely. was void and still seemed incomplete. So he just blew the darkness all away, and then he made the light, and he called it day. At his command, the whole creation came to be. And the earth was a great big puzzle. A rainbow of colors all around. But it bothered God a little Cause parts were missing in the middle So he made the missing pieces from the ground
He made the whole world and still wanted me. So you took a little piece of clay and made me. Made Greg and James, Tay and Tiffany, and all my other friends. You've given me strong legs, good eyes, fishing poles, creek banks, tadpoles and turtles. You even made girls. Some of the time I like them. Give me a mom, a dad, my, my big brother, and my little puppy. You're a great God. I'm sorry I forget to thank you and do things for you. If it weren't for you, I wouldn't have anything or be anything. I guess I'd still be mud. Dear God, help me never to forget you like some grown folks do, even when I get older. What is it that you can do tonight? I believe he, they've expressed it to us as well as anybody could. That is simply to make us seeds to be planted. God wants to take you and to plant you and then to grow you into something beautiful and someone beautiful. As I sit back and watch these children sing, it just excites me, not whether they're on key or not on key, but what they've given of themselves to make this available to you and me tonight. And that's what he asks, God asks of us, not that we're on key particularly, but that, they're will, that we're willing vessels. If you listen very carefully, you won't find any wrong notes in what they've sung. 
because it comes from the heart and when it comes from the heart led by the Lord Jesus Christ it's going to be on key and it's going to be so full of joy and happiness that we'll be able to share in what these precious children have done for us but God is looking to you God is looking to me and he's asking us to become seeds seeds planted in the earth and for that seed to produce it must first die and so he tells us that he beseeches us he pleads with us to present ourselves a living sacrifice willing to be by God's strength placed into the soil of this earth that we might die to self take up our cross and follow him and perhaps that's what he's speaking to you about tonight perhaps you need to take up your cross and follow Jesus Christ right now I believe they're going to sing a little bit for an invitation is that right and I wonder if where you are you would stand quietly and just bow your heads for a moment right where you are just stand with us please and Joyce can we get the side lights just two switches on the far side the Lord has spoken to you at all about any decision that you need to make we want you to make it right now if you want someone to pray with you if you have some need in your life that you need to just let go and let God have then you come right now quickly while the choir sings Christians I pray that all over the building you'll join me in prayer that God might be blessed for what we've done tonight and let it begin right now